My name is Caitlin Witherell. I'm a fourth year PhD candidate at WSU in the Immunology and Infectious Disease Program. Our lab is currently partnered with the Fred Hutchison Cancer Research Center in Seattle. We are working on developing novel therapeutics to kill multidrug resistant bacteria. Multidrug resistant E. coli, Acinobacter baumanniae, Klebsiella pneumoniae, and Pseudomonas aeruginosa. So that's a lot of science jargon, but pretty much these are bad bugs that cause skin infections and are hospital acquired in some cases. When you start talking about antimicrobial resistance, and we can throw out all kinds of mind-numbing numbers, literally, I mean, we're talking, and the range is huge in terms of impact and what that will do to people, but I prefer to have people focus on their families because it doesn't matter what you're doing. You're going in for a dental operation, you're going in uh, for a birth, you're going in for a, a wound or a burn. Every procedure that we do in the hospital offers an opportunity for an infection to occur. And if those organisms are drug resistant, they're gonna impact you. It's not just coming in with some bizarre exotic infection. This is an everyday challenge that will increase as this crisis grows. I like problem solving and it's very clear in infectious disease what the problem is, there's two ways to solve it. Number one is kill the bacteria. Number two is stop the bacteria from growing and allow your own immune system to take over. So it's a very clear, this is the problem and this is the solution. Now, how do we get there? You're answering a completely unknown problem and you have to work to think critically and pull from different avenues the knowledge that you already have to come up with a conclusion that may or may not be right. You hope it's right. I hope for the best success for all of my students. I mean, we have an, an adage here that your success is our success. And as long as our students are being successful, obviously that defines our success. I have had a lot of private support help. I have received an ARCS fellowship, achievement rewards for college scientists. I have received a Ponson fellowship, and I have received a CVM, College of Veterinary Medicine scholarship. With private support, I'm able to focus my energy and time on doing my research, which is the most important part of being in a PhD program. Research involves asking tough questions and finding answers to those questions. We try and design mechanisms to test those ideas, and oftentimes we're wrong, which is good. If you can design something that shows that you're wrong, you've still learned something, and we can move forward to the next step. Uh, so it's a rigorous way of, of looking at the world, and, and that's why we do research. Is, come up with rigorous answers. I love being so close to a solution. I can really see how my research will affect the lives of people in the future. And it's not some very obscure problem. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. If this research works, it can help people and it can help a lot of people, not only in the United States, but also around the world.